like a bird on a tree. I'm just sitting here. I got time. Hello, Chapter Two crew. Well, the children and I went to Salvation Army. I didn't film. I just, I was just a shopping. I really didn't think that I was going to find much in there. We went for half off day for the kids, like clothes and stuff. But I found some stuff. And um, I'm just going to do a haul video. So, all right, let's go see what's, what I got. So here it is. Woohoo! And the kitty. All right, so these are, this is the stuff that we got at Salvation Army when I went. Now, this is the uh, Goodwill stuff from the day before. Um, the kids and I did stop at Goodwill, and I picked up, like, this and I think this when we went. But this is from the video that you guys saw the day before. These are all the things that we ended up getting. I just wanted to leave them out on the table so you could see that is the fancy Goodwill stuff. Oh, and I found this that day too. All right, let's fast forward to Salvation Army. So, as I was pulling in uh, to the parking lot, uh, Rachel from Manor House Vintage was messaging me. And she was sending me pictures. And she's like, oh my gosh, Alex, look at these mugs. They totally remind me of you. And I'm like, oh my gosh, you have to buy them. I will send you money right now. Buy me some, please and thank you. So, <laughs> I went in. And when I went in the store, I found these four. Now, this one has a little boo-boo on its ear, but that's okay with me. These are Johanna Parker um, art right here. See, Johanna Parker design. Now, she sells them online on like a holiday type website. I can't remember it off the top of my head. But then every once in a while, they'll end up at TJ Maxx. And I've never been lucky enough to find any of her stuff at any of my TJ Maxx's or anything. So I found those. And then looking around a little more, I found the bat, which is really cute. Again, it's got a little ding right there, but I don't care. And then looking around a little more, almost missed this guy with the corn body. Um, I got him and he's just so cute for fall. <gasps> oh, I'm so excited. Now she was able to find, I think it was these mugs. She said the owls had been sold. Um, and she got some salt shakers that she's sending me. And I'm so excited. So, I got those, right? I got a candle by Opal House, which I think is... Um, blah, 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 Target, maybe. I got a pair of these really pretty made-in-Germany little salt shakers. They, like, remind me of seashells. But it says Germany on the bottom. So I got those. I'm not sure. Maybe like a little giveaway or something. I have quite a few people that collect salt shakers. I've never seen those before. So then we got these Otagiri cats. Really nicely made. This is a Yankee Candle shade. So I was showing this to Jesse actually. I had my little Yankee Candle here. This is what Aaron says. I never take the thrift stickers off when I keep stuff. <laughs> So, um, usually you can't find the underplate. Usually you only find the shades, but this is what you would do. And it creates a pretty lamp out of your candle. Now, um, if you find these Yankee candle things, they have them in like ceramics like this, you know, or glass, the holiday ones actually do pretty well uh, for resale. So, um, but yeah, I picked up this like cornucopia pumpkin one. Actually, this is from Goodwill, too. This shouldn't be over here. But I picked up this one. I really love the colors of this one. The pine cones. It looks so pretty all together. So that actually goes in this pile. So, yeah, got that. And then Erin had spotted these really cute set of coasters. That kind of reminds me of a pumpkin or something, but it has these bows here. So we got those, great for fall. I got this, ooh, this scary kitty cat, really neat. We got a fairy lamp, and this one is 
from, it says Shannon Crystal. Wait, it says Retro Candle Lamp, yeah. Still in the box, that's probably gonna be a giveaway. I scored two brand new Bath and Body Works candles. Yes, I did. Hold those there. Two brand new, and those are fantastic smells. So, Vanilla Bean Noel is Vanilla Bean Marshmallow Fluff and Vanilla Cake. Yum. And Vanilla Bean Noel is a different than Vanilla Bean if you go there um, shopping. In the Stars is Bergamot Champagne, Night Blooming Water Lily, and Pink Salted Amber. This was also a Christmas scent. This came out as one of our Christmas things, um, um, I don't know, about four or five Christmases ago. I got a couple of cool boxes here. That's really neat. Look, it looks like a playing card. It has a little bit of wear, but it's so cool. I got that. I don't know if, if that's going to be in the sale or on eBay. I think the sale because I need some, a few more items. And then this is really cool. I don't know what material that is, but I love the color and stuff. So I picked that up. It's like a, like a really deep emerald green. So I got that. And then I got some of these aluminum tumblers. And look at this chubby cat. Now this is the artist James Haddon. And he makes um, like all kinds of animals. This cat in particular resells between like 15 and $20. So this will probably go into the live sale as well because on eBay, um, you know, I've, we've definitely grown since we started. So my eBay items, I definitely try for the extra work that it takes to do that, you know, to put into eBay. I try and pick up things that I could make at least like $40 on. So, I mean, I have some sale items and stuff in there that have been sitting there. So I've marked them down since, but now this is a hand blown glass from Bermuda. This great like pink and blue. I just thought it was really cute. It's a nice weight too. Um, this was another thing. Like this was sold as a set. I was really lucky. And uh, so she sold me this as a set. And then these were like single. This is another thing where you had to buy the set. And I really liked these two pieces. This is not really my favorite. But so here's this one. And this one is like um, pottery. But these are um, Grecian pieces, little tourist pieces. This one was my favorite. I just love the animals that they do with that copper color and the black. I love it. So there's that one. And then this one, this is ceramic as well. Handmade in Greece. So I had to buy all three of those to get these two. Then this kind of reminds me of the signature for, I don't know. I don't know if that's HP or if it's for the Padilla pottery, you know, that makes those mugs like this. I don't know if they make candlesticks. So, and then he signed his name outright. So I don't know. It just looks very familiar, but I could be wrong. I picked up this pretty peacock picture frame because I really liked it. It's not old or anything like that. I just thought it was really pretty. And then I grabbed these two giant egg paperweights. They're really clear on the bottom, so that's cool. Really neat. Whew. So that is everything I got over there. I still have some stuff from the other store sitting on the table. We ended up only getting one glass flower because the other one's petals were broken. We got a wall pocket. We did buy these birds. Um, and I have some other things on the shelf. Let's see. I showed you all this stuff. The duck. That's so pretty. The, the Oh, the figural candle. I love these. I have a little collection. Hopefully they're not melted. <laughs> 
let's hope that they're not melted. And then we got this big old paperweight and I have quite a few of these little stands in my case. Here, I'll, I'll take you over there and I'll show you. All right, so here's my little case I was telling you guys about. And I use different things for the stands, but I have this one. Um, I think I have another one somewhere else of this one with these feet. Might be inside, but I use these brass ones. There's one right here. That's probably, you know, it's probably for a candle or something, but. And this was free. A lady at the flea market gave me this one. Someone in my house dropped this one and didn't bother saying anything. Look at that crack. Mm-hmm. Probably happened when we were moving everything, but. But I've got some really nice ones. This one's signed. This one's not signed. But I think I bought it. For Reese, yep, and I saw that it was broke after the fact, of course. This one's really cool. Isn't that neat? And it says, Julie loves Troy. Well, not anymore. And I have this little metal thing down here that's actually like an old, um, like salt, an open salt. And I just used it to hold this earth that needs a holder or else it's gonna roll every dang where. But yeah, so I have like that big guy, a couple of these. I need to get, um, not need, I don't need, but I need to put bigger ones back there, like this size on those holders. And then up here I have this holding this guy. And then in the house I have some other ones. But those are how I, I just use those different kinds of things to hold my paperweights. It makes it more interesting. Um, like when you talk about design, because of the different height variations, it, like your eye kind of travels. So <sighs> anyways, I just thought I would share that with you guys. Here's some of my metal detecting things. Lots of cool things. This was a gift from someone. This wasn't from me. And so was this, like I found this. Oh, quite a few of the other things here. Um, these rings, the jewelry, then some, here's some, um, this is a uh, post office um, money. It's from 1869. That's when the post office had their own money. Very cool. And I have some keys in there that I found, some other stuff in here. Really neat. So yeah, that's how I use um, the paperweight stands anyway. So, all right guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys are able to pop over to our live sales. We host two of them every week. Um, sometimes there's an extra one, but they're on uh, Thursday nights. Is that broken? No, Thursday nights at 7 p.m and Tuesday, or Tuesday, oh well, my gosh, where'd I get Tuesday from? Sunday afternoons, Thursday nights at seven, Sunday at two. That took a lot of effort. <laughs> so I hope to see you guys there. Um, yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. Bye. It's clear to see from up here the world seems small we can sit together It's so beautiful